Welcome back, folks, to Fisher Planet. I'm Super Dave, and today we're going to be talking about different ways to get bait coins, or uh, I guess you call it bait coin farming. So I'm, I'm going to show you a few different ways. Let's start off with the, I guess, quote-unquote easiest. This isn't for everybody, but you can actually buy them if you do want. But I'm going to show this to get it out of the way right away. If you guys do want to buy them, they are right here. Uh, I wouldn't recommend it. Fish and Planet does have a bunch of other ways to get bait coins, but if you are in a pinch and you just want to get them, you can get them this way. Uh, another way to get these is if you go to, uh, for example, any of your missions. If you see there under rewards, you can see bait coins. And uh, there are plenty of missions to do to get bait coins and highly... Highly, highly, highly recommend doing it that way. Uh, a lot of these don't take very much time and are uh, very effective in giving you other gear that helps you as well. Another way, guys, I would recommend that, uh, uh, you know, uh, quite a bit is your challenges. So if you can see here on a leprechaun, or for example, a leprechaun challenge, you get 13 bait coins for it. Um, there's a lot of these missions that give you bait coins as well uh, are these challenges that give you bait coins here in fish and planet and this is a really really good way to get them as well uh, some other things I also uh, want to mention if you have event or DLC items you don't want for example uh, you know, I get rid of everything I don't use, whether that's a good idea or not, uh, is up to you. But for example, this hat is from a DLC and when you go to sell it, you can get 30 bait coins for it. This is actually an event item and you can get bait coins for selling that as well. I only recommend it if you don't plan on keeping or using that item, uh, uh, another way to get the bait coins also, and I'm going to try to keep this video short, so I'm not going to go into too many details on this one, um, is your comps, guys. The comps do give out quite a bit uh, of bait coins, especially if you get into the tournaments where you can win 9,000. Like, for example, the last tournament gave the winner 9,000. Uh, now this is this is a tougher one, but if you get good at this, this is a great way to get bait coins. Also, I want to mention too, as well, is is if you're a lower level, this actually is an easy way to get bait coins, and uh, all you need to do is these amateur comps, and you get bait coins. And as you can see, there is a lot less people in these. Some of these actually get canceled. But if you go and you can see here, uh, there was only seven, so it's a lot easier to win, especially if you have somewhat of an idea of what to do in these. So that'll help you out if you're low level. Uh, another, this is probably one of the best ways to do it, guys, is sponsor comps. So if you go into custom comps, you'll see these gold looking ones these are sponsored comps uh, and as you can see there's different types of them but if you go into them uh, for example oh details we'll go to details and you can see you get bait coins from these as well now there is different versions of these and here, let me back out of this really quick um, I highly recommend team ones like this where it puts half the field against the other half and if you look here the winner each winner will get five bait coins which is a very big and you have a 50 50 chance essentially at getting that most of these you are going to want to check too for the bait coin rewards team events give a five to the winning team uh, your average sponsor comp will give 20 to first place, 10 to second, and 5 to third. But just keep in mind, sometimes uh, Fishing Planet allows higher tiers. For example, 
when I do my sponsored events, the uh, bait coins are 100, uh, 50, and 25. Uh, so there is different tiers of them. So keep an eye out for that as well. And probably the easiest way, but the most limited time way to get bait coins or to find farm bait coins is the St. Patrick's Day event. Uh, it, every year you're able to catch uh, fish for bait coins, one of them being the rowdy bass, and you can catch them basically anywhere with bully grasshoppers and a two-out hook on a bottom rod or a full pole. Just as during the St. Patrick's Day event, the leprechaun fish gives you bait coins as well, and you can catch them with a the drunken worm on a to uh, hook at any of the lakes. So hopefully this guide helps you out farming bait coins or getting as many bait coins as you want. And uh, if you need a guide to uh, know how to spend them wisely, I will put that down in the description as I just did that video as well.